What's up, what's up? How's everybody doing? Surprise. I'm still gonna do multiplayer games later on Twitch, but... I was gonna just play a ton of Pixelborn, and I was like, why don't I just stream it? Why not? Also, I can get an idea of what we want to play later, because I have no idea. Um, let me just set up so I can see the chat on my phone real quick. I forgot I had to do that. And there it is. I was almost done setting that up. Let me just mute my phone so I don't hear myself. The volumes look good. I'm not going to be a super long stream. like an hour tops probably all right I can see stream chat rather got a lot of decks this game Lorcana is in a good spot right now there's a lot of different color combinations that are viable and good but then there's ones that are bad that I still enjoy let's see if we can win with the healing princesses <laughs> Not a meta deck by any means, but it's very fun to play. We win by healing. And healing and healing. Mew, what's up? How's it going? Can you tell me how the volume is with my voice and with the music, please and thank you? I have to get rid of the uh, sounds in this game. They're off, okay. Let's see. I figured you meant hey or hi. <laughs> How you doing today? Uh, we want him. He's our win condition pretty much, but we don't want him yet. Um, we're hoping to get a small version of Rapunzel. Popsicle's very good. Okay. They're playing... Sapphire and Ruby, which is a very good color right now. It's one of the top three decks easily. Where is everybody? They'll come in. I just went live. I just decided to stream, so... Alright, we don't need the Cinderella. Oh, I got rid of the Flavorship. That would have been good. Oh, well. Ooh, Dinglehopper's good. We still need the little Rapunzel so she can turn into this one. You're the first one here, Mew. <clears throat> but yeah, how's the volume with the music and everything? Alright, they're gonna play Simba, that's fine. So I have to put out a creature, I don't have... I mean, we could just use Jasmine at this point. We can ink something. Jasmine, and we'll play Dinglehopper. It's good, thank you. Yeah, you're the first one here. You did it. So this is going to quest for three, and then they're probably going to have some way to ready it, so I can't punish it. We'll see. Not a great start with my hand, but again, this is a super casual deck. I don't expect to win. But that would be cool. Characters quests, we have the top deck. Okay, so we scry for every time we quest. That's kind of crazy. Yep, that's a good play. So when Simba dies, they get him back as ink. That's fine. We can't let him live. You gotta do that. That's fine. draw with another popsicle. This deck has a lot of items. Another let it go. Alright, we don't need that many. Man, we didn't get the uh, creatures we need. Not at all. But we can heal Jasmine off with Dingle Hopper. <coughs> this is going to be a problem. I don't have like an offensive attacking deck, so they're going to get lore from this every turn. I don't know if anybody was here before. I said I'm going to stream for like maybe an hour. It's not going to be too long. I just felt like playing a ton of this. Oh, they're putting down everything. They realize I'm not aggressive. 
Alright, that's a problem. Because I have creature removal. I mean... Um, so I don't want that, so that goes to the bottom of the deck. We can be kind of aggressive here with this aerial. But I'm going to have to hit this thing three times. It's going to get like six lore for them. But they're low on cards, and I have a better board. I have more cards out. I won the Battle Royal. No way. I beat you, Mew. <laughs> Let's see. So I am going to stream later on Twitch, uh, play some multiplayer games. I want to play uh, Shredder's Revenge, the Ninja Turtles game. So I'm trying to get a group together for that. Oh god, they're going to win just because they have so many locations. I'll play it out. I don't really quit until I know there's no way I'm winning. There's still ways around all this. Just depends on the next couple draws. A little square. I drew all of these. We only really needed one at one point. We don't need any now. Uh, I think we can get rid of that. Play her. And we have to, like, try to get a lot of lore. I'm not even going to attack their locations. Uh, we don't want that. Uh, we don't really want her either right now. <coughs> They're going to get one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I don't think we're winning this. I have no way to remove these quick. Even if I drew what I needed right now, I can't come back. This deck I don't think has any locations. It might have a McDuck Manor, I don't know. A little smarter. <laughs> I know what you meant. Yeah, yeah. That's funny though. They don't win next turn, but the turn after, these win it for them. It's five, yeah, it'll be 22. Good game, good game. <coughs> I'm gonna get a win with this bad casual deck. Let me actually... I haven't played it in a while. Which build am I going with? Jasmine Popsicle, Jasmine Morris. Oh, this is a weird one. Four Grand Poppies. I think I have another version of this. This one... One jump ahead is different. Repair. I got Wonder yet? No, I'm not really going to worry about Wonder. The 3D Marios kind of fell off for me after Galaxy 1 and 2. I haven't even played Odyssey, which I would actually like to play that. Well, I know Wonder's like a 2D one. I meant 2D, but... I only like the old school 2D ones. Part of your world is... Eh, I want to run that at 2. We need something that can come out and hit hard. Let's see. Could go aggressive. That doesn't really... Minnie's a pretty good card. I want to put her back in. Moana's solid. We'll do two Moana, two Minnie Mouse right now. Because she's a princess, so she falls under that. We have all the uh, Rapunzel's, right? Yes. Okay. Let's try this one. Oh, we're two cards over. One Grand Pobby. And... <laughs> oh, we don't have the Jasmine in here either. You know what? I like the other one better. I'm more used to this version of it. We'll just run with this. <clears throat> You're almost done with Wonder? How are you liking it? It looks fun, but like 2D Mario, like I said, if I want to play it, I'll play World or I'll play 3, my favorites. Uh, lab. We're going to get a win with this bad deck, even if it takes the whole hour that I stream. Did I say hi, Eevee? Hi, Eevee. Again, hi. 
Alright, they're gonna be running an aggro deck with these two colors. We get to go first. That is enormous. Ah, this time we got the little Rapunzel, but not the big one. So we're doing a mulligan. We're throwing cards back in the deck and getting new ones. It's kind of like five card uh, poker, if you know about that. Five draw. That Jasmine's good. Ariel, Dinglehopper. I mean, we have a lot of good one drops, but I'd rather have a Popsicle. I think we get rid of... This is tough. I don't think we need two Dingle Hoppers right now. We have one in hand. Uh, we'll play this. Would you play Cat Quest? I don't know, man. Also, I have that paper where I wrote that and all the stuff you told me to look at, but I honestly have not looked at it because all the papers that were on my desk that are important, I moved. They're on my bed right now. <laughs> but I still have it. I promise I'll get to them. That was you who had a lot of stuff you were showing me last time. I was on YouTube, I think. Alright, this does nothing right now. They're running a healing deck, too. That's kind of weird. I know you guys probably don't play this game, so you don't know what's going on, but the card game is called Lorcana. It's a Disney trading card game. This is the online client. They do have actual cards and tournaments and stuff. I have a couple decks made, but I can't really get around to the game stores, so I don't play too much IRL, only with my brother and his friends sometimes. So I get a lot of practice on here. <clears throat> boom, boom, boom. Olaf, okay. It's an RPG. I mean, I love RPGs. Alright, we need the big Rapunzel that can shift onto this one. Yeah, trading card game like Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh, Magic the Gathering. There's a One Piece trading card game now. What's up, guinea pig? What's up, Emilio? How you guys doing? Uh, I think I play her this turn, and the next turn I can drop this and get the effect. Or I could... No, I'll get her out. Board presence. And we will quest with this one. So essentially, when you turn your card sideways, you're either attacking another creature, which you can only do when they're grayed out like this, or that one little diamond shape on the right side of the card, bottom right, that's how much lore they can get. So I just got one lore from Rapunzel turning sideways. Play the Splatoon Splatfest? Ah. Mmm, I don't know, maybe. Splatoon's fun, but it's definitely not like a main game, you know, for me. And I feel like when I do a Splatfest, if I'm playing, my team is at a disadvantage, and you're actually, like, trying to win. So I feel like I would just be holding my team back, you know? It's not turn-based? Yeah, just like Pokemon cards. You can build a deck and play against people. They're physical cards, too. I have decks and a ton of cards. Yeah, there's a One Piece uh, trading card game. I'm not into One Piece, so I don't play it. There's a lot of, like, there's a trading card game for Dragon Ball Z. There's a Star Wars one that's kind of new. It's crazy. I said something. I just read it. Give me pig chill. Give me a second. Chill, bruh. Alright, that's fine. I'm not going to kill Olaf because she can get two lore. I can outpace them. Ooh, we got the Grand Pobby. We don't need him yet. But that's a good draw. Ooh, I could put her down. I think... Uh, she's, like, good late game. I really want to get this out this turn. So we can control what we draw. if we want this next turn or not. I want him next turn for sure. And then we'll just... Hmm. We'll be aggressive. And 
we want to keep him on the top of the deck. Let's see if they go aggressive or if they go for the lore. Guinea pig, just repost it. It's fine. Yeah, Mew, trading card games are very big. Um, when I was younger, I played a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh! was probably my main one. But that game, in my opinion, sucks now. It's too crazy. I don't enjoy it. But I play Magic the Gathering and this game, Lorcana, with my brother and his friend when they come over. Uh, the Pokemon trading card game. I worked with kids for a long time, and I would bring my Pokemon decks and play them. because Actually, it was cool because they played Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Magic. So I would bring all my decks of all those card games and play with them. It was really cool. That was my job, essentially, because I was like a glorified babysitter, I guess. It was like an after-school program. Oh, they've got the Rafiki. That's not good. That's good for them. That's not good for me. He can come out and attack right away. What are they going to attack? What are they afraid of? They can't kill this one. Okay, they're going to trade. Okay. So now we need another creature to take care of this Mickey Mouse, because he's a problem. Yeah, I miss that job. I was there for 16 years, and I'm 35, so a long time. This is tough. Let's quest with her, so we get this effect. We're going to draw. I don't want that. We can actually save him. We can put her out to beat up Mickey Mouse. Yes, we're going to beat up Mickey Mouse next turn. I'm not going to ink that. Yeah, Rafiki, dude. Rafiki is my favorite character from Lion King, and there's not even, like, anybody close. Scar is my next favorite, probably. Are they going to double attack her? That would be weird. They're probably just going to quest. How many of these characters do you guys, like, know or remember? Because I know we're different age groups here. Like, I thought he was from some Trolls movie. He's from Frozen 2, apparently, which I didn't see. I saw the first Frozen, because, again, I worked with kids, and we would have movie days when it was, like, snowy or rainy or whatever. Not that Disney movies are for kids. I mean, I know all the classics. Alright, they're grabbing a Moana. This is good. This is not like a meta deck, and this is kind of a casual one, too. So it's a nice little matchup. A Mandrill? Yeah, I know he's not a baboon. A Mandrill. He's the best. I love him. And the only reason he's my favorite, it's really funny, is just because he kicks the crap out of the hyenas at the end. <laughs> I love that so much. That's my dude right there. Oh, they managed to get her out. This is a problem. They're going to outpace me now. I'm going to get to draw two cards next turn, so that's fun. Draw two cards from playing this and banishing one of my items, which will probably be this one, I think, has to go. Uh, let's see. So we're going to quest first so we can get the effect. I'm actually going to kill Mickey with her if she survives. Um, we can actually fully heal Ariel. Um, I'd rather get the uh, effect from this one more time before I banish it. We could use another Ariel. It's very good against this deck. I have to ink one, so it's going to have to be Jasmine. <clears throat> see what we draw. Come on. Good stuff. <laughs> we don't need him yet. He costs 7 to play. We're at 5. That's not good. I remember watching it. Oh, you watched the live action one with like the actual animals? What's up, Ayumu? How's it going? I know you recognize all these characters. You're like the biggest Disney fan I know. 
so they're gonna have to double attack her to kill her. Because I healed her for one. Oh boy. <laughs> The live-action ones I haven't really enjoyed. I liked Aladdin and Mulan, but I think that's just biased because those are my two favorite, like, classic ones that got a live-action. Oh, they're going super aggressive. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna have to banish the Dingle Hopper, unfortunately. I need to draw more cards. What's the opposite of these words? Always coming and take me down. I'm not entirely sure what you're asking. I don't know, man. Take, take me up. All right, she gets three lore when she goes on a quest, so I have to kill her somehow. I don't have the power to right now. If we can get these dudes out, we win. Every time I heal, they give me two lore, so I can just keep healing things. They're running a similar deck, but instead of blue, they have purple. That's fine. Oh, that's what we need to get rid of Moana. Okay, that's huge. I think we just play that. We don't even... Uh, let me heal. Oh, this is the special zone from Sonic 2. This is a Sonic playlist, by the way. I think? Is that a fork from Ariel? I don't know where this is from. It might be. Um, so we're definitely just going to play this. Bye, Moana. Let me just get rid of her. Now we can get rid of this. Drawing these two is very bad. I can't use them for a resource here. guess we can kill Olaf. Oh, I should have... It doesn't matter. We're gonna tap her to heal Ariel for two. She can heal a princess. Or she can heal anybody. Yeah. Uh, this is like counterintuitive, but we need to draw, so we get rid of our healing item. I'll just get another one. No, but we got a popsicle. Very good. Let's us draw another card. Interesting. Okay. Next turn, we can uh, start our strat. Oh, you're trying to rickroll me? They were going to give you up? <laughs> Steamboat Willie has a horror game? I saw that. Olaf wants warm hugs. I don't like Olaf. He's weird. I don't know. Yeah, I, I sang Let It Go at Moana, and she flew away. <laughs> I sent her to the ocean. Alright, so they can attack with him and have two damage. Okay, that's fine. I want them to be putting damage on my characters. That's going to help me, actually. This is good, but I would have wanted it earlier. Oh, he's got Rush. They're trying to take him out. Okay, okay. I'm hoping... Well, it doesn't matter if they attack someone else or him again. Perfect. Are they going to sacrifice him? That'd be an interesting play. They might have Pascal finish off Blavish. Who knows where he's from? He's from one of my favorite Disney movies that nobody ever talks about. Think, Mark. <laughs> Think. Is he going to sack it? He knows I'm going to draw. Oh, he quested. That's interesting. They're playing kind of weird. Oh, we got another Let It Go. We're going to save that, though. So, this is going to be a big turn. We are going to... I would like to play her, but honestly, we don't need her. We're going to get one of our grand poppies out. <clears throat> so, every time I heal one of my characters, I get two lore. So. We'll heal Flavisham. And we get two lore. I can banish this to heal again, but I think I want the draw instead. I want to draw cards, so we'll... They're going to kill him next turn. Though. That's fine. We're getting two cards. If I heal them with it, it goes away, so I had to pick between... Oh, hello! That's lucky. Uh, do we need more lore? 
Yeah, we want to make them attack our characters. The let it go on Moana swapped the whole game around. They were kicking my butt, I think, if she stayed out. Oh, uh, Maurice, yeah. Crazy old Maurice. Alright, so Rafiki's gonna take him out. That's fine, he let me draw cards a bunch of times. He did all his work, he did great. Now they'll probably attack twice on Ariel. Or maybe if they know what strat I'm going for, they might try to kill Rapunzel. Whatever they do is fine, because we're ahead now. And I'm about to throw out another Grand Bobby. So. How do I even make Blitz laugh? Uh, tell me a joke. <clears throat> if I were them, I would take this out. Alright, that's fine. Because she's just going to keep healing stuff. Say something very funny. Magic broom, that's fine, from Fantasia. Now, that Flotsam is going to be a problem. I'm going to have to maybe let it go on him. We'll see. If I can get the bigger Rapunzel right now, that would be legendary. Dinglehopper would be good. I won, let's go. Oh, you gotta win? Let's go. It's a pretty close game, actually. There. Is he too lore? Okay, he's dead next turn. I have to kill him. Uh, they don't win next turn, so if I maybe get her out. I have a lot of options here. Hmm. The first thing I'm gonna do... I think I might actually win here. Now that I have two of these, it activates every time I heal. So we're going to play Popsicle, draw a card, doesn't matter what we get. I'm going to use her to heal Ariel. We're going to get four lore. Yeah, we win actually. All I have to do is have Ariel hit something that won't kill her. We put damage back on her. And then we heal with Popsicle. And these guys will give us four lore. We win. We don't even have to quest with them to get six. <laughs> I'll tell them good game. Well played. It's over. Victory! Alright, now I can actually play good decks. We gotta win with my fun deck. What do you guys want to see? Some pirates? I haven't played this deck in a long time. Yeah, don't beat up Princess Peach. How dare you? It's not allowed. You can beat up Daisy all you want, but Peach? Nah. No, no, no. So I'm playing Lab. I play Ranked sometimes, but honestly it's the same like three or four decks, and I'd rather play like my fun versions of them. So if I want to be like, if I, once in a while I'll pull out like the meta deck and play Ranked, but I'm just kind of chilling for now. I like seeing the more casual decks people play. I've seen a lot of stuff that's pretty interesting. GG, thank you. Alright, they're playing a good color combination here. Very good. And this deck, again, isn't like a good meta deck. It's just more of a fun deck. Uh, I got a lot of freaking locations. I don't really need... We got three Agrabahs? Bro, we'll take one. We'll keep an Agrabah and a turn one Captain Hook. <clears throat> we got a lot of Captain Hook. Like, this is a pirate deck, but holy crap, we have one, two, three, four, five. Five Captain Hook creatures. That's so funny. Oh, they didn't get a good hand, they gave up. Okay. We'll take it. <clears throat> Oh, this is the best color combination right now. This is scary. Hopefully they're not playing the, uh... Oh, now I go second. Oh, man. 
Oh, I forgot Robin Hood was in here. He's not really a pirate, but he works well in here. Yo, where's the other land? The one that costs one. Uh, we'll keep Agrabah, maybe? No. I could have gotten rid of a Captain Hook, too, actually. No! What the hell? All those Jim Hawkins? Oh my god. He's a good card, but we don't need three. Yo, Captain Hook is great. They're going to destroy this deck. This is a... Uh, oh my god. It's a five drop. We don't need that many of him. I know most of you, again, aren't really into this game and don't know what's going on. If you have any questions about it, feel free to ask. I don't mind explaining at all. Ooh, the Jolly Roger's good. We have his ship. I want to keep two Jim Hawkins, this guy, during her fashion, Okay. This is actually tough. I kind of want to get rid of a Jim Hawkins. Characters gain rush while here. They are going to make Grandma Tala attack this, so she dies. When she dies, she becomes a resource. That's the only reason they're using her. Alright, we need a good 3-drop. Pirate would be nice. Oh, they're playing the songs. So they're ramping, which means they get a lot of ink, resource, really quick. They can be there, but they don't really need the rush. <laughs> Look at all of our Captain Hooks. They're everywhere. We'll let them get another ink, that's fine. We drew very badly so far. Look, I have two, I'm gonna have three at the end of my turn, but they have six. Uh, I'm gonna have to choose, these are all very costly five drops. Next turn, we can get this out. <clears throat> Yo, three Captain Hooks is crazy. And they have seven ink already. That's gonna kill one of these, that's fine. And then they're probably gonna kill this one. Oh, they don't want to tap that. They want the effect. Okay. This is no good. We're drawing very badly, unfortunately. I think we got to get rid of the hook, unfortunately. I don't have to attack and let them kill my characters. I'm just going to... I'm going to chill. Jim's coming out next turn. Captain Hook plus Captain Hook plus... Yeah, plus his boat. <laughs> Might as well be a Captain Hook deck. Top two cards of your deck. That's fine. I need them to tap this, but I don't think they will. They're playing Let It Go. I mean, it's funny. I'm still winning, technically, but... I'm drawing so badly. Yeah, where was he before? Oh my god, this is a very good card. We'll get to him in a second. Uh, we're gonna play Jim Hawkins. When he comes out, I can play a location. We're gonna play the Legacy. We're gonna put him at the Legacy. Um, I'm not gonna do that. Again, I'm winning. I can just chill. Uh, yeah. You put Animal Crossing? Roblox? What's up, Cross? How you doing, bro? Can you guys shout each other out? Please and thank you. 
Oh, they got the big grandma tall. This is a problem. That's fine. <clears throat> so this John Silver, when he comes out, for every location I have, I'm going to have three. Oh, that's a good card to play, too. Damn, that's tempting. Uh, there's a couple things I could do here. What I think we'll do... What I'm gonna do is play this John Silver. Move him over to the Jolly Roger so he gets Rush. So he can attack this and only take one damage. That's fine. We gotta get rid of that thing, that's a big creature. <clears throat> um, I think we can quest with this. You know what? No, I'm gonna chill. Actually, they might go after the... Yeah, let's be aggressive. We're winning. They might try to attack this instead of killing him. Oh, they can't kill him. He is evasive. We're good. We're good. Robin Hood next turn. Yep, that was smart. They got rid of that. <clears throat> Alright, they played the best card in the game. Lame, but okay. So they're playing the best color, but they're not playing the best cards. And... Oh, this is actually not bad. I'm sure they have a bunch of cards that are going to come out and just kill him now, but I get to draw if they kill him through a challenge. Alright, Bell's there. That's not a big deal. Also not a big deal. We really don't need this. That's such a bad draw right now. So, Bell is going to quest for a lot. That's their plan, is late game using her. <clears throat> oh, wow. They're so lame. They are playing the deck everybody's playing. Never mind. Um, this is probably extremely stupid, but I don't think I can win otherwise. Eh, it's a lab game, it's whatever. Let's see, we got a Mr. Smee. I think we just play a ton of cards. Because next turn they get... I don't think they can win next turn. Five, five, five. Yeah, they win. I thought it was four. Lame. They had the perfect hand dropping two bells and the dime. Alright, now I want to play an OP deck. <coughs> you uploaded two videos of Berry Kiss? Ooh, I need to see. Oh, we got Smart Gaston. What is this hand? No, no. Alright, the popsicle, these two are good. Everything else is out of here. I might keep the queen because we can play her on turn two. We're hoping for a quill, fishbone quill. There it is. Wow. Alright, we didn't need two. We have a very good hand. Let's see if we can win with it. I've been streaming. I can't even see. Nope. Not on there. On here. 
40 minutes. No Gaston. I know we need him later though. He's not good early on. He's a he's a He's just taking up a spot basically. He's very expensive to play. Alright, they got the queen. No, Grimatol, get out of here. This is a good card, but we have a better turn four character to play. Um, we can play her just to have a presence. Next turn we ink something, we play this, we tap it, we put her in there. Next turn we play him. I play a lot of card games, so I know like to think ahead. Alright, they're gonna protect with Simba, that's totally fine. I don't think we need... Actually, I do want two fish bones, I think. No, Shield of Virtue is very good, though. Oh, we don't need... Oh, Maui's Hook might be good, though. Eh. We're gonna drop Lady Tremaine in there. Play that. Pass. <clears throat> so we're kind of doing what the last deck did against us. We're trying to get resource very quickly. Scammed? Oh, no. Go Peach. Comes into play Exerted. Okay. So they have a better board right now. But I'm just setting up for later, pretty much. Two cards. Ooh, Maui's gonna be very useful later. Meaning next turn. Another fish bone. We can probably do this to one of them. So they're gonna get a lot of lore this turn, and then I'm gonna kinda destroy their field. I think they're playing an all characters deck, which I have one too. Oh, I know this strat. What's up, Anna? How you doing? Oh, that's a good time to draw Be Prepared. That's a real good time. For me, I can screw them over real hard. Let's do that. Watch this. They might rage quit. Watch this. gonna throw Grandma Tala and we're gonna play be prepared it kills all creatures or characters in this game so I definitely won that trade and I'm not gonna ink any of these I think I want to keep all of these cards we're ahead on ink I don't need to drop something if I don't want to I don't know this or I know this song it's from Sonic and Knuckles is this Starlight Zone from the first Sonic? Yeah, I think it is. No, maybe not. Damn, I'm a fraud. Uh, that Goofy's gonna be very annoying. Let's put this out so they have to deal with that. Let's ink this and we'll play her. And we'll take another McDuck Manor. And that's it. Oh, it is Labyrinth Zone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, of course. Yeah. Wow. Oh, do they still have Rapunzel? Mm. I can't do much about what they're about to do. I wonder which one they're going to sacrifice. When she comes out, they have to choose one of their characters and kill them. If it's Goofy, then they definitely have the Rapunzel that lets them draw. If they heal. <clears throat> Hydronic? Yeah, they have Rapunzel to heal her next turn. That's fine. Uh, and we'll 
religious quests. Fine with me. Play your Rapunzel. I'll kill her with Maui. Yep, of course. This card is a $40 card. I own five of them. I should sell one. And just like that, they've got their advantage back. But what are they going to do with her? They're going to quest? Okay, that's fine. Uh, we re really don't need her right now. I think instead of playing this, we'll play him when he can kill her. For now... Yeah, for now we'll just play more cards. We'll play another manor. We'll play another one of these. We'll draw a popsicle. Quest. Quest. They're gonna have to outpace me, or they probably have to be prepared to kill everything. We'll see. I'm not gonna ink anything. We're good. <clears throat> Ask Cross. Yeah, Cross knows his songs as well. Yeah, $40 is a lot for a single one of these. What's up, Star? How you doing? They're ahead on card in hand. I'm ahead on field, so I think they're going to kill everything. It's just going to be a race to get to 20, and if they don't kill my creatures, I'm going to win. I'm going to be killing their creatures. Y'all ready for this? Oh, I don't even need to use that, but that's a nice uh, thing to have in the pocket. Let's be smart. Let's do this. When Maui comes out, he can attack right away. Boom. Then this shield, we can pay three to untap him so we can use him again. He's going to kill Mother Gothel. We win at this point. They can't do anything. Next turn, these are going to win it for me. Let's give them the, uh, the well played. Because they don't get seven lore this turn. And they don't have anything that can kill these. Not with these colors. That's fine. So Scar can keep attacking until he dies, pretty much. But they can't stop these, so... <clears throat> I'll say it again. Good job. This is a dub. I had a very good starting hand. I had all the pieces I needed. GG. Make a video on playing Refreshed. What is Refreshed? Oh, Rebrushed. I don't know what that is either. Alright, let's play this deck. We're going to make them discard everything. We're not going to let them play the game if we draw well. Also, guys, while I have you, I'm streaming on Twitch later. Uh, what multiplayer games should I play? I don't know who, who here is using Twitch or will be there, but... I know I'm playing uh, Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge with some friends. But I want to play a different game as well. Oh, that's good, Star. I'm doing well, thank you. Sorry, I just saw that. Uh, interesting hand. We only need one of this Flynn. Strike a good match is decent. We don't really need it at this moment. Kit might be good, so we have a turn one, two, three.
Oh, Yumu, you want to play Smash? Or are you just saying to play it? Or Mario Kart? I haven't streamed Mario Kart in a bit, I feel like. I've been playing it in friend streams, but I haven't, like, played it. Or streamed it, rather. Alright. Well, we don't need that card yet. That's expensive. So, we're gonna get two. And then we're going to bodyguard, protect the merfolk. Next turn, I want to play this one, and then we'll get him out later. We can get this out soon, actually. Why am I playing Dark Deity? I have it up right now. I was playing it before I switched over to this game. Why are you spying on my profile, bro? I'm just kidding. That's fine. Because what I'm going to do next turn is still going to throw them for a ride. How much is it? Two? Hmm. I think we ditch this Flynn. We didn't get a lot of our discard stuff. That makes this one kind of not great. So we can wait on him. If I bounce him, yeah, we're going to bounce him. He'll be free to play, but that's fine. Yeah, this is on the PC. And Dark Deity is up on my... Because I almost finished a chapter, I didn't want to... You can't, like, save in the middle of the chapter. So I just have it up and I'll finish it later. Because I'm at the end and almost killed all the enemies. So they definitely have a lot of cards in hand, but I have the field advantage for now. I think they're going to play a Robin Hood, and they're going to play another Robin Hood. The big one. Like, they're definitely doing that. They're playing Ariel. That's a very strong card. They get to search the top four cards for a song. And she can sing songs that cost five, even though she's a, a three cost. Oh, you're just saying it? Okay. Yeah, on Twitch is tough. I'm trying to grow on there. And also, I know a lot of people don't have Twitch or don't want to go there, which is totally fine. But it makes multiplayer games hard. <laughs> but it'll still be a good time. I think we get rid of this. We quest, and we quest, and we quest, and then we play the Pride Lands. Characters there get plus two to their toughness, so now he's harder to take out, he can protect them. And if there's a prince or king there, my characters cost one less to play. So, pretty good. I feel safe. If they have a card called Grab Your Sword, they deal two to everybody, that would kill these two. That would suck. So I'm going to try to get the Merfolk over there next turn so they can be tanky. They got the Robin Hood, of course. Hey, that's fine. Fine with me. <clears throat> um, that's an interesting draw. Uh, 
each player may draw a card. I don't want to give them any sort of advantage, so we're going to do this. I mean, I have 13, they have zero. Pretty confident on this one. Frederick, what's up? More Kingdom Hearts game? I wish Kingdom Hearts was in this. Maybe someday. Alright, so they're going to kill my Merfolk, and they're discarding to do so, which is fine. This Flynn is stronger the less cards they have in their hand. What did they discard? Another Lantern, okay. They're going to get two lore, because when he kills something, he gets two. Totally fine. I can just stay, like, passive. They really don't have much. Unless they have Grab Your Swords. Which I'm hoping they don't. Oh, they already inked this turn. They couldn't play it anyway. Well, they can sing it with her. That would be devastating. I think that's what they're trying to do. Oh, they have five. Oh, crap. Here it comes. Here it comes. They're playing a Steel Song deck. This is one of the top three strongest decks in the game. Yep. Oh, well. We're still in a good spot. <clears throat> I would love to get a... Uh, one or two cost Flynn so I can play him for cheaper what's their last card if they oh wow I got what I needed just what I needed Taking my boy out. <clears throat> Another collab? Yeah, maybe. De well, I mean, definitely. Let me know when you're thinking. Alright, can they kill this guy? Nope. They should be trying to kill this. This is the original Robotnik boss fight music. Boom, 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 boom. Wow, really? Okay. They gave me a whole new hand, which is very nice of them. I got another Simba. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, now we super duper won. They did that so I can't quest with him a lot, which was actually smart, I guess. But they also gave me a ton of stuff to work with. Hmm. Lots of good stuff to work with. Stars and hearts on his avatar. I can't see the avatars right now, actually. Oh, they're trying to go wide. I really needed a Prince John. That's what I needed. Um, we don't need two bare necessities. That's two, four. Bodyguard, put him there, and then play an Ursula, and we'll play, we're going to go wide too. I'm sure he has another thing that's going to do two to everybody, but it's not going to be as devastating this time. We'll make him discard a card. Got rid of a beast. Alright. <clears throat> they have to clear my field this turn or I win. Oh, 
alone with Luigi is just reminding me of the adventure game of Luigi trying to find Mario. Oh, Mario's missing? Is that what you're talking about? Alright, so they're going to use that to just zap my dude. That's fine. I don't think I can stop everything that's happening. That's fine. They're going to draw. I'm going to be at 17. Actually, it's not good that they're drawing because they're going to get that stupid swords card. Let's see. They're just called avatars. Did they get what they wanted? I'm sure they did. They should also kill this. They have a lot of things they have to do. <clears throat> what would I do in this situation? Well, I don't know their hands, so I can't really say. Okay, that was smart. They don't have the card that I was talking about. Good. So I win. There was just too much for them to do. Unless they can play other stuff. Yeah, that's it. Let's give them the, the well played. And then for fun, we're going to make them discard some cards. Because <laughs> I'm a jerk. I just wanted to see what they were holding on to. GG. Let's go. I love that deck. We didn't even get the, like, discard part of it. We got the aggro part of it. Have you seen my brother? Like, how is he right now? Uh, let's play... Let's play the deck that has only characters. Oops, all characters. So, I might end after this one. But I'll be back on Twitch. I'll post it in the Discord. If you don't know what my Twitch is and you want to, do exclamation point Twitch and it'll pop up. We have a very good hand. Big Pluto. We don't need Big Pluto. But we are going to play Little Pluto. It took three sets for them to put Pluto in Lorcana. Like, come on, bro. That's Mickey Mouse's boy right there. Oh, I see. Have you seen my brother? Okay. We don't need... Oh, two Simbas might be really good, actually. Hmm. They're playing Steel, so this card isn't as good as it would normally yeah because piglet is going to be huge um let's do this and pay for him to come out cool his emotion is <laughs> thank you cross That's a little scary because they can kill Simba. Alright, let's see. So we can do... I want to play Piglet this turn. And that's what I'm going to do. But first, quest. We need to play him for nothing. As Pluto reduces cost by one, Doc does the same thing. And then we put out a Bodyguard Simba. I'm not going to ink this one, because I want to use him to protect later. <clears throat> I 
once again, this is a deck that's very weak to that grab your sword card. It's going to do two to everybody. That's, yep, he had to attack that. That's fine. We got another one for him next turn. Oh god, Ariel. Such a strong card. It's in every song deck, pretty much. Just too good. Another Pluto. I really need ink, but... Uh, I guess we can just keep getting characters out, but if they have that one card, I am screwed. Okay, let's do this. Um, we gotta put out the Simba this turn. I don't want to put this out. I feel like they're going to kill everything. We'll save Pluto. They're going to find a way to kill this card. Because Steel has a lot of things that just do damage without attacking. He's literally cooking. Oh god. They have a long came Zeus. Or Smash. Or Grab Your Sword. Or Let the Storm Rage On. On Piglet. Bye bye. He put in work. He did what he had to do. There's Grab Your Sword. Why didn't... Oh, he wanted to draw from the other card. Weird. Yep, you have to kill Simba. Alright, that was no good, but whatever. This card is not useful right now. Doc is going to die, but on his way out, he's going to bring Prince Eric out. I'm not drawing anything I can put in the inkwell. It's really bad. He's dead. <clears throat> this card is OP. If it dies in any way, it can just kill something on the field. Oh, thank you! I wouldn't have played that there, to be honest. That's just me, though. They gave me a hand. I mean, they got one too, but whatever. That's fine. Pluto's going to kill Doc. Totally cool with that. What does gold do? Nothing now, but I'm going to be recoloring sprites. So, like, if there's a Pokemon or any... Like, if there's a Pokemon avatar you want, shiny or a different color, uh, I can do that. So you can buy, like, a custom avatar, pretty much. Same thing, if you wanted, like, Luigi in pink, I could do that. Ooh, do I do that? I think I do that. Get rid of two powerful cards for my one? Yeah. Oh, I have to kill... Well, no, never mind. It doesn't work the way I want it to. This turn, we can just play... Mini. The quest. We gotta get to our stitch. Yeah, I have to figure out how much I want to make them cost, gold-wise. And also how to recolor them. I think I have a pretty good idea, though. Just do it through Photoshop. Alright, now we gotta kill these aerials. Now there's a problem. Them having two of these. Oh yeah, they're going wide. They said, you know what? It's time to play. Okay. Another Prince Eric is not bad. A Simba is pretty solid, though. Do they win next turn? Yes, if I don't kill anything. gonna put me back. I think they just have too many creatures out. I can't really stop them. Um, that would kill her, so let's quest. Okay, 
Generation. We'll make Eric die. So we can kill Lilo. And then... That's tough. I think I have to play Eric again and try to get rid of more of their characters. Not having ink for a bunch of turns really hurt. They'll get to 19, they're gonna win next turn. I don't win this. Because their location will give them one no matter what. Ah, I could technically kill it. I'll play it out, let's see what they do. But I do not win this one. They're playing meta versus my silly all characters deck. A non-character? I have to play all characters. Not into an elephant. I can change their coloring. Like, I can make a Pokemon shiny, or I can actually make... Like, Garchomp shiny people hate. So instead of making the shiny Garchomp, I can make it red. Or whatever color, you know? It's going to be completely custom as far as the color goes. But I won't be able to, like, add stuff to it. <clears throat> That's a weird play. I guess they figure they're going to win anyway, so. Which they are. I have no way to stop. Play it out though, why not? These Eric's are so good, but a little slow. We'll just be petty. We're gonna kill their Aladdin then quit. I'm so stupid, I could have killed him much earlier. I wasn't even thinking of getting rid of him. And then for the Wolves, we'll play. Chernabog for free. That was close. <clears throat> Completed a level in Wonder. Nice. Alright, I've been winning. I can't end on a loss like that. I don't want to play a tryhard deck, though. Ooh. Let's play the Jafar deck. I love Jafar. He's my favorite. One of my favorite villains. Him and Gaston, although Gaston is... He's technically the antagonist, but, like, he's not a villain villain. He's just a jerk, but I love him. This deck is actually really good, but you need to be very lucky and draw the right stuff more than a normal deck. So I'll be back later on Twitch in an hour and a half from now at 6 o'clock. And I'll start with Shredder's Revenge, and then we'll switch to, like, Mario Kart, or Smash, or Mario Party, something. Alright, they're playing a discard aggro deck. Okay. Not... We have good cards, but none that work together. Like, we need the little Robin Hood, so I'm gonna get rid of one of him. Probably gonna end up getting the big Tinker Bell now. I'll keep that. That's a turn two. We need to turn one character. Honestly. And there's a bunch in this deck. Where are they? There's one. Robin Hood. The one we needed. We got two. Just in case. Nice. Nice. Um. We don't need that just yet. So our plan is to play all these cards really quick and then play a whole new world and reset the hands when I have nothing and they still have cards. So let's see if we can do that. They're not playing Steel, so they can't just kill him. It's at finding a worthy opponent. Sometimes they are worthy, sometimes they are not. Merfolk, I knew it. 
that's fine. Ooh, there's a Jafar. Snake Jafar. We gotta get him out eventually. Uh, they don't have anything with Rush, so I'm safe to get rid of this. We're gonna play Forbidden Mountain. Just a location that'll give us one more. Let's quest. <coughs> Next turn, we make a lot of big moves. But thank you guys for being here. I know, again, you don't play this or really care, but it means a lot that you're still here just hanging with me. I love this game. It's a very fun game. They're going to quest with that. Totally fine. Especially because... Ooh, I'm going to get two more off that too next turn. <clears throat> That's fine, do that. We don't need two of these, it's an easy discard. Discard that, I guess. When Robin Hood kills something, we get two. <clears throat> if they have the big queen to play on this, we might be in trouble. And then next turn, we're going to play some stuff. Because they have a bunch of cards in their hand, so I can kind of just dump what I have, you know? This will be the last one, win or lose. Because I should eat before uh, I stream again, right? I have not really eaten today. So my first meal will be dinner, pretty much. <clears throat> Bucky, okay, that's fine. Oh. Um... I'm pretty ahead right now, so I don't want to reset the hands. It seems silly. Because I can just draw stuff. Hmm. Let's have him sing Friends on the Other Side. Now we have a lot of unickable stuff, so next turn we are definitely um, resetting our hand. <clears throat> they have no way to kill him, so that's fine. Welcome back, Mew. They got rid of Simba. <clears throat> Doc, okay. Oh, I got the Queen's Castle, bro. We gotta do that. I still don't think I want to play this. Like, I'm ahead, so I don't need to give them seven new cards. I think we just sing this. Kill Doc. <laughs> Play Queen's Castle. Get that passive lore from these. We're in a good spot. <clears throat> they might play something to make me discard. I didn't think of that. If they play a card that has shift in the name, then I have to discard this, which would be devastating. Did not think that through. We'll still be fine. I can draw cards through this. But they're definitely playing a Beast or a Robin Hood. Oh no, they don't, they're playing... They're playing Kida? Oh, or the Queen, okay. 
got to get rid of that. Good play. I didn't want to give them extra cards. It's fine. I'm still ahead. I have to play more passive now because she and him together can kill Robin Hood. That's why he's questing, because he knows that. What do we get? Ooh, that's pretty decent. Uh, do I want to, though? <clears throat> the queen's actually not able to kill him now. just toss this and as long as he is on this location at the start of my next turn I get to draw an extra card we're gonna win just from the locations they don't seem to be trying to take him out you're doing special world levels awesome I haven't seen too much of wonder played but it looks fun merfolk that's not gonna help them at this point They have no damage on the board. They have five damage on the board, and they have to take out 13 points of HP, pretty much. Okay. Get to draw an extra card. What did we get? Ooh, Yzma. <clears throat> and Tinkerbell. gonna kill Robin Hood but I'll get to draw a card from it no big deal <clears throat> we got this one they have no cards and three lore we're getting to 19 next turn with these so they have to kill him otherwise I just win right there that's fine I'm not gonna be attacking into their creatures Bucky's gonna kill Robin Hood if they want to last one more turn. They do. Fine with me. We get to draw when he dies. <clears throat> That's going to be game. Um, play a Floodborne character. You draw a card. Doesn't matter. Yeah, they're done. <laughs> Alright, that's it. GG's to my random opponents. We won most of them. We lost one with a good deck, and we lost a few with the healing princesses, but we also won with that casual deck. Let's raid somebody. I don't normally stream or end at this time, so we should have some good options, right? Who's streaming? Who streaming? Everybody's streaming later, oh my god. Ooh, Little Tiger Big Heart is playing Mario Kart. I didn't mean to rhyme. I'm just you know, if you guys are still here, thank you so much. I just was going to play this for a bit, and I was like, let's just stream it and catch up with people. Why not? So, Little Tiger Big Heart is awesome. I've been to his streams. He's very supportive of everybody in the community. Thank you, Cross. There's his link. Go drop the tag. Go give him a like and a sub. He's awesome. And join him for some Mario Kart if you want. And I'll see whoever's going to be on Twitch later for some more multiplayer games. Have a great afternoon, I guess, evening. I'll see you guys later. Thank you again. Peace out.